We at Upstream are so excited to announce the release of our 2022 Global Automotive Cybersecurity Report. Now in its fourth year, this state of the industry report presents a sweeping view of the cybersecurity risks faced by the automotive industry and every stakeholder related to it. Our report brings you up to speed on new regulations, addresses increasingly sophisticated cyber attacks, which are a danger to vehicles on the road like these today. This report pulls insights and statistics from over 900 automotive cybersecurity incidents. I was amazed to see that in 2018, we saw only 75 incidents that impacted the automotive world. Whereas in 2021, that number jumped to over 240 incidents. That's a three-fold jump in the number of automotive cybersecurity incidents in only four years. We specifically highlight issues and considerations related to the cybersecurity standards regulations, which are already impacting the automotive industry today. This year's implementation of UNECE WP29, R155, and R156, and ESO SAE 21434 require cybersecurity commitments from OEMs long after the vehicles leave the dealership. Exactly. And the findings related to R155 are incredibly interesting. 89% of incidents fell under subsection 4.3.2, that is, threats regarding communication channels. 88% fell under subsection 4.3.6, that is, threats to vehicle data or code. 24% fell under subsection 4.3.1, that is, backend server threats related to vehicles in the field. Also, 56% of 2021's attacks were carried out by black hat actors, a jump of over 15% from what we saw in 2020. They targeted critical charging infrastructure, backend servers, and even various governments. Automotive cybersecurity incidents cost the industry $505 billion in 2021 alone. Upstream's team of automotive analysts broke down the incidents to help the ecosystem stay one step ahead of the ever-changing automotive threat landscape. Download the 2022 Global Automotive Cybersecurity Report to get this vital information today.